Hi, this is Dr. Sylvester and I'm going to talk to you a little bit today about fixing a moderate bunion deformity, a bunion deformity that's not too severe. Uh, most of the time it's women who suffer from bunions, not men, largely because men can wear wide sloppy shoes and we're generally just tr trying to get around. Women are trying to wear more dressy shoes and, and be a little more conscientious in how they look. And so moderate bunion deformities generally occur in patients that are younger, 20s to 50s years old. They're not too difficult to address. They, there are certain procedures that can be done very successfully that allow you to bear weight fairly quickly after you've had a moderate bunion fixed. And this allows you to go on with your life and experience a foot that functions more normally. A lot of people ask me if those bunions can come back and my response to that is if they do, then in general what's happened is that something's been overlooked. Either the stability of the first metatarsal, the severity of the deformity, the patient wanting to sort of push the envelope. Sometimes we let the patient dictate what kind of procedure they want and pushing the envelope as far as the requirements for the surgery can cause some degree of recurrence. But in general, vast majority of people do not get their bunions back. As far as recovery goes, Usually it's about two weeks of laying around, keeping your foot up. A lot of people take medication for pain. Very many people also don't take medication for pain. That depends on how their response to the surgery is and how much swelling they have. As far as getting back in their shoes, usually it's about three to five weeks before you get back into a loose tennis shoe and three to four months before you get back into a dress shoe. So that sort of answers most of the questions that revolve around having a moderate bunion fixed. If you have any questions, please give us a call at the Next Step Foot and Ankle Clinic and we can help you out. Thank you.